Hi Thomas and hi Guido. We are here um, together with Mirek. Actually Mirek today created the prototype of your isolator on his own. So he should be showing it, but I am showing in the end. So this is the model of Guido that we received. And this is the model uh, from us that we created today. <clears throat> Uh, what we changed slightly is the length of wire, one millimeter less, so we are sure that it fits very well in uh, Bayenhof uh, hive, that it's about three millimeters shorter, so I will show you later that it fits very well. Uh, we uh, removed this, this kind of support because we think that this is strong enough because the, the main strength is here on this edge, so you can you can really hang it very heavy and then nothing will happen and we created the very simple cover lid now in our isolator here in the bottom between the uh, the bottom of the frame and the bottom of the isolator is around four or five millimeters space so the bees can go around the frame and this is actually the standard that we do in all our isolators uh, we will discuss it when we meet. So um, I will show you how it fits in the in the hive. Here is the Bayenhof, which is uh, shorter. We will put it here. And you see it fits very well. There is even two millimeters space between the walls. And uh, when you put the cover on it, like that, you will see that it it sits very well. There is no space, there is no nothing. The cover, when you put it to the maximum side, then it will not make any bee space that the bee can go off. Uh, of course, it also fits in the nectaris hive. Like that, it sits very well. This hive is a bit taller here, but still, when you, uh, just a sec, when you put something straight on it, it sits very well on the, on the box. So, this is how it looks. We also modified here the edges, like that. And everything is strong here, even this is 0 0.5 uh, steel. That's, uh, I, we, are, we are sure that it's uh, strong enough to hold, to hold the isolator. So we will be discussing it with you, uh, all the details when you, when you come and visit us in March.